All right, so we have a bully stick. Oh, it doesn't tilt. Not this one. Uh, oh, well. Oh, oh, sorry. I know. We can lower it somehow. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, from here. There you go. Ah, whatever. It don't matter. Hi. Zuzi. Zuzi. So we have a bully stick. And what I really want to do is leave him alone because like often when you're right there petting them uh, It's okay. They don't have a problem with it because they don't feel like you're gonna steal it It's often when you are going to reach for it uh, And he's already been busy and you haven't been part of the whole the whole you know uh, Being a being with the stick that they get uncomfortable. The problem is that cat is being too loud so um, she's distracting him too much. <laughs> I'm teasing. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. He's got like little plant things all over his face. Alright, so I'm gonna try to step away without him being so, um, you know, while he continues to chew. So the goal is this. I say O-U-T from a distance, and then if he doesn't, then I penalize until he does it, and then I, I give it back. Hopefully he doesn't get too sad, uh, because sometimes they get kind of like, oh, I don't, I don't like that, if I have to use a lot of aversive. Hopefully he just does it. Um, but we'll see. And I also have the gloves. So I'll have the gloves no. just in case. Yes, good boy. Nice, good boy. Go. No. Safe. All right, so he's now chewing it. So I'm gonna just step away and leave him alone for a little bit. See how we do. I hate Lucky. the smell of these bully sticks. Say. Say. Yes. Okay. I used to get the knuckle bones from my dogs, and they'd have like the plain ones, and then the ones with the meat, and that's quite the similar smell. No. Oh. no, no. Always got the plain ones. Tal vez se lo dejé muy socado. Pero a ver si hay otro. Acá creo que hay. Sí, acá hay, acá hay unos cuantos si necesitas. Si necesitas más. Yo creo que son distintos. Pero bueno, creo que siempre caben. Alright, Zeus out. Zeus out. Good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good. Good boy, stay. But notice that he didn't want to let go, like compared to, if you guys saw the video yesterday, uh, watch the video where I gave the other bone, he couldn't care less about that one. Um, so he was letting go and he didn't go back to it, so he didn't care. This one, uh, I'm making sure that he understands the concept of outing and letting go and walking away from it. Hopefully he does it on his own one of these times. If not, I will increase intensity. 
Eventually, we're going to use the e-collar uh, so we can achieve this the same way with a greater sense of urgency. Ready? Ready? Go Alright, this time I'm just going to walk away because like, I don't want it to be a pattern every time I get up. I'm going to make an yes. OUT. Maybe I'll do this. Maybe I'll just go. Super hard tug because she's got puppy teeth, so they can break. let go on his own but I did have to still sort of like get him to go away from it because you never want to reach because if you reach towards it that's where you have conflict now will we do that at some point we'll try it with a glove and stuff so we can penalize that but if we have a method and everybody follows a, a, a method that's non-confrontational then it's more likely that he will just do it right um, I'll do it one more time. If he does it right, I leave him alone because this is very annoying to him. Zeus, out! Out! Come on! Zeus, out! Come on! Come here! No, he's not. A couple of seconds, nothing, so then pop. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry, buddy. Okay, good, good. So that was a hard one. Good job. Come on, bring him in. Bring him in. Bring him in. Nice job. You get stuck a little bit. You get stuck a little bit. Oh, he's a good dog. So I did a hard one there because he understood it, but I needed a greater sense of urgency. I let him chew it on me, but then we'll do that again, and I want to make sure that he does it on his own, and then I'll leave him alone. He can chew the whole thing. Hopefully it doesn't give you diarrhea, man. I mean, I think he's had bully sticks before, so I don't think he's going to get diarrhea, but he's going to end up eating. I think he's just going to chew a little bit, not eat the whole thing, but I think he'll eat it. He likes it a lot. All right, so I'm going to bring me over here so he can chew it. Alright, I'm gonna leave. Is he still chewing? No, he stopped. He stopped, I know. He's expecting it. He knows that every time I, I get up, um, he, we're gonna say that. So we're just gonna leave him alone. I'm gonna walk away. Just tell me when he re, re, re. starts chewing again? Yeah. yeah. Restarts with the weather. He jumped off the couch. Oh, buddy, come on. He's like, well, I don't want that hard one. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So he's trying to avoid it. Zuzi, here. Zeus, come here. Nice. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, Zeus. Zuzi, here. Yes. Come on, Zuzi. Come on. Nice. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Free. Come on, buddy. Free. Come on, buddy. Free. Come on. Oh, that was nice. Oh, buddy. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. I know. Good dog. Uh, we're gonna have to wait a little bit longer for him to chew, 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 and then we'll try that again. Him for him to chew it up, but um, 
at least you know he has something high value and I can cuddle him and he's understanding it. We need to practice more.